along with Ray Ferraro, who's down at ice level. My name is James Sabalski from way up here high, set to bring you all the action. Hershey's in control. Question is now, can they close it out? I don't see why not. They are obviously in a position where they've been the better team in this series. That's fair. You need one more win to put this to bed. Both teams lined up in the middle. We are ready to get things underway. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. The Bears are going to be shorthanded because of a tripping call. Trying to get to the puck, he reaches his stick right into the guy's feet, and down he goes. Our first look tonight at their power play unit. Uh, you know, James, I like offense, I like goals. I even want to hear one of your goal calls. You haven't had a chance tonight. Stopped by the goaltender. Nine seconds. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Still scoreless in this one. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. He was left in there. Hartford's got it in the offensive zone. Snaps it on net. Gives them nothing in front. Sends the pass over. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Here's a chance. Fires the wrist shot. His reflexes on display tonight. Oh, aggressive move as he pokes it away. And manages to clear the zone. The Wolfpack have possession along the boards. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Power play is over. Both teams back to even strength. Well, no go on that power play. They were able to move the puck around, and I guess at times it looked dangerous, but just nothing really going on the power play. They let that one slip through the fingers. Maintains possession. Hartford's got the puck at center. Here they come on the attack. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Nice dish from the left wing. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Gets it to the other point. Jones setting up against the wall. Here he is with the backhander. Oh, couldn't finish the job. What an excellent opportunity, Ray. They worked their way into good shape. He's just not able to beat the goalie. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Hartford's won the draw. Stopped by the goaltender. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And a strong defensive effort to get in front of that. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Picked up along the boards by Brzezinski. Takes a shot and makes a save. Copley's goalie coach was talking to him about burying that. He's got a step. Great stop by the goaltender. Positioning and quickness. That's the day right there. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Takes the pass. And he gets a paddle on that one. Tangles him up with the stick, and the officials are all over it. They go on the attack through center. And the puck stopper tags his man to get the extra attacker on the ice. Move to the middle. A chance from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. And play finally comes to an end. Here's the officials. And it's going to be two minutes for hooking on the call. A lot of people debate, is this a lazy penalty, the hook? I don't know if it's lazy all the time, but it's a penalty of being out of position. Your stick's parallel to the ice. You get called all the time. 
Hartford's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, they get another chance here. They've earned the power play. They haven't got anything on their power plays yet. Haven't had a lot of them, but here's a nice chance for them. Puck move back to the neutral zone. Great burst of speed to come up with it. Hartford's in transition. Let's it fly and puts it right over the crossbar. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. Takes the feed moving in. Hartford's got the puck against the half wall. Stopped by the goaltender. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. Too many bodies in the way. Hershey's penalty killers get a hold of it. Centering pass. Stopped by the goaltender. That's not a very clean stop, but it turns out to be a good one. He got a lot of the puck, just enough to keep it out. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Still no score in this one. Hartford's got it, and they're on the attack. A strong penalty-killing performance on that one as both teams are now back to even strength. Well, as that penalized player comes out of the penalty box, he can give a nod down to his penalty-killing unit. They did their job. Outstanding work. Feeds the puck across to Jones. And he gains the zone here. Trying to get back on the attack now. Slides the puck over. Here's a chance with the stop. Receives the pass. Handles the puck. Puts it to the front of the net. Beats the goalie, but can't beat the post. Hey, can we have a bounce so somebody can call a goal here? That shot hits the post and stays out. Nice pass. Couldn't complete the play. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. The Wolfpack have gained possession off the wall. Looks to set up at the point now. Oh, and he can thank his stick for that one. As a great older colleague of mine says, this is waffle boarded away. More than half the frame has been played here. Still looking for our first goal. The Bears win it. Scooped up along the wall by Johansson. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Sends a pass over. Manages to hang on. Big play inside the defensive zone. Schilling's got a hold of the puck behind his own cage. That pass goes a little sideways. Grabbed along the boards by Johansson. He carries the puck up along the wing. Fontaine's got it in the defensive zone. The Bears have it in the offensive end. The Wolfpack have gained control of the puck along the wall. Hartford's got it in their own zone. The Bears played along the wing. Hershey's gained possession along the boards. Misses! Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. And I think about as big a stop as you can come up with so far tonight, that's a much-needed whistle there. When you're running around in your zone, you're always yelling at the goalie, freeze it if you can. Finally, he jumps on it. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Hershey's won the faceoff, and he makes the save. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Moves the puck. Moves it around along the half wall. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. And they can't convert to the play! The Wolfpack have taken possession along the wall. Hartford's got the puck along the wall. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Hershey's across the blue line. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. 
takes the feed. Moves right to the middle, and they can't finish that one. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that. The play was there. He just doesn't execute that last pass for the scoring opportunity. The Bears take it along the wall. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Takes the feed at the point. Takes a wrist shot. Puts it high. Yeah, it sounds great. Hit the net, though. You got a better chance to score. Locks it down with a stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. We got a penalty coming up here as the officials blow the play dead. Nieves may not like the call, but the officials still see it as hooking. So quickly into position, now the defensive player's got to scramble. He takes the hooking penalty. Hershey's sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. They haven't had a power play yet. The game's scoreless. This is a fantastic opportunity to break the ice. Off the try, and a nice job locking up his opponent. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. The Bears have it behind the net. That's moved up ahead. Moves the puck along the half wall. And that's stopped by the goaltender. Great save to stay with it. Here in the late goings of the period, the game is still scoreless. Back underway as he wins the try inside the offensive zone. He grabs the puck here at the point. Deflected away. Off the post and into the back of the net. Just a quarter of an inch keeps that puck out. If it hits the post more directly, it stays out. As you're a shooter, that's a great sound. He had enough time to wind up for the slapper, and he zips it past the goaltender on the stick side. Hershey's on the board first. You got a feeling that they were kind of due here, Razor. Seemed like they were starting to generate a chance or two more than the other guys, and they capitalize on one, and they've got a late lead. Dished on over to Sprong. By number 42. Moves it to Carr. Let's it fly. Misses a... No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. Rocks him. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. They've got the defense outnumbered. To his teammate. Centering pass. Look out. Off the mask of the goaltender. Boy, right between the eyes. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Takes a shot with the stop. Move to the middle. Puts the puck on net. Great reflexes. Another save. Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Centered out in front. Here's a chance. And puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. Intercepts the pass at center. Handles the pass at center. The Wolfpack have the puck against the boards. Takes the feed. Tries to get the puck to Nieves. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Well, it's an opportunity for fans to stretch their legs here as the opening 20 minutes comes to an end and a chance for these players to catch their breath. The Bears skating off with a 1-0 lead after 20. As both teams get a breather, so will we. We'll take a quick pause for the cause. Waiter service and free team merchandise. Your time is now to reserve your seat in one of our extravagant luxury boxes. See our website. A chance for both teams to refuel. They are back on the ice, and period number two is about set to go. Here we go, middle frame now underway as the puck drops. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? Both goaltenders have looked really confident so far. They've been sharp, they've made really good stops. There's just one goal in the game. Right to the middle, takes a shot, and that one's turned away. Hangs onto the puck. Hartford's got it in their own zone. Sends the pass over. Excellent stick work on the play. Stays with it. Knocked away. 
big save in front. Urkins is brought down. A penalty on the way. Hershey's got the puck against the boards. And the officials will pass the sentence here. So often in a in a shifty little play that you're trying to get to the puck, you get your stick in the wrong spot, he steps on your stick, and there's nothing you can do. And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. As someone who played a lot on the power play, you get one early in a game, it gives you more confidence. They look like they're ready to get another one. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. They get it out of the defensive end. Slides the puck across to Carr. From one end of the blue line to the other. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Sent into the offensive zone. Slides it over with pace to Carr. Just wide. Not really close with that. He got lots on it, but nowhere near the net. Battling for it along the boards. The Bears will play it in their own end. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Makes a move in front. Way too much congestion blocks that. Big save. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, that's their job. Get it down the ice. Get off the ice. Get some new people out there. Scores! That's back to back, Ray. Well, the, the game has changed. Those two goals here really have changed the outlook. That's a scorer's goal right there. That puck is on and off his stick in a hurry. He's so tight to the net, he has to get rid of it before the goalie can readjust. The Bears make their way back to set a race here with now a two-goal lead in the second. Nice to pad the one-goal lead. They've played well, and now they've earned this spot in the game. Grabs the puck at center. Oh, smart heads out play to put that one away. Hershey's got a hold of the puck. Nice zone entry from the middle. Picks up the puck in his own end. Through center along the wing. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And that's broken up with a stick in front. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Hershey's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. Turn that one aside. The most fun save for the goaltender, the glove stop. Hershey's done a nice job of generating pucks on net, and as a result, they lead here in the second. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. That's taken away. Great defensive effort there. Hartford's got the puck along the boards. The Bears have it in the offensive zone. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Tape to tape pass the center. Pinned up along the boards. Takes control of the puck. The Bears have it now. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Strong defensive effort. Hershey's got the puck along the wall. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Hartford's on the attack. Takes control of the puck. Great stretch pass as he connects. Molson's caught up with the hook, and the official saw it. Let's see what the official says here. The Wolfpack have been handed two minutes for hooking. As soon as he stops skating, he has to reach out with his stick parallel to the ice. It's going to get called most every time. Hershey's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Once you get a power play goal early in a game, you start to feel pretty good about yourself. Now you get another opportunity. You feel like you're going to score for sure. Great defensive stick work on the play. Simple glove save by Kincaid. More than half the period left to play. 
And it's a 2-0 hockey game. While the setters are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Oh, we got a tripping penalty coming up here. The officials were all over that. Let's get the call here. Uh, you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. As we get set for the face-off, a chance to see both teams in a little four-on-four -four action here. I love how four-on-four -four play has evolved. It used to be race up the ice and shoot the puck. Now teams and players are way more comfortable holding the puck and waiting for the play to develop. Hartford's got a hold of it against the wall. Through pass ahead. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Hammers the one-timer over the net. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Denies it in front. Kincaid's been excellent. His save percentage is terrific tonight, but they are just not finding anything at the offensive end. Hershey's lead here in the second period, a direct result of being the more aggressive team offensively. Takes possession off the draw. Takes the pass. It's an opportunity for the power play unit to go to work now as the penalty expires. Another stop by the goaltender. Fires away! Unbeatable! They're wearing down the other team's defense with this cycle in the offensive zone. And time expires on the power play. Both teams back to even. I like the work the penalty killers did there. The power play at times looked dangerous, but they didn't give up anything. And the power play is now over. Air mails it! Did he ever? He's got to bring that down a couple of feet. Jostles the puck loose. Receives the pass. The Wolfpack have the puck in the defensive zone. Jones looks around. From the slot, nothing doing. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. Inside the offensive zone. Hartford's grabbed a hold of the puck. From the neutral zone now. Puck scooped up by Jones. Here's a chance to set up now. Quick pass to Fontaine. Slides the puck over. Launches it from the point! And a beautiful stop by the glove! been perfect so far he's kind of doing this all by himself so busy and he's been phenomenal tonight James and Ray with you tonight more than half the period has been played the Bears lead this one to zip and as the puck is dropped they win the draw here inside the defensive zone Hershey's got it against the boards Hartford's got a hold of it along the wall long reach breaks up the momentum couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Handles the puck. Shot right in front. Scores! Three is the magic number. And that goalie is getting just torched down there. Three in a row here. He doesn't waste any time getting this puck off his stick. The snapshot beats the goaltender from the high slot. Hershey's been dominant tonight as they make their way back to center. They have scored almost at will, in particular here in this second period. The Bears get a hold of the puck off the draw. Regains control here in the neutral zone. The Wolfpack have the puck in their own end. The Bears have it against the wall. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Good hit to pump him off the puck. They fight for it along the boards. The Wolfpack have gained possession off the wall. A little bump and grind, but still hangs on to the puck. Back to the blue line. From point blank range. Too much congestion in front. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. From center, they get into the attacking area. Passes right to the front. Turns it away. He scores! Now it's only a two-goal game. Also, it gets progressively better for them, but they need another one. They got to throw a quick back-to-back -back goal up here. I
I think he almost gave up on this. He can't find the puck, and he just stands there. This thing beats him cleanly. He never saw it. The Wolfpack have still got a two-goal deficit to overcome, but they've got one here late. Probably make them feel a little better. Now you've got to chase that next one before you really open it up. Quick feed to Thompson. The Wolfpack have possession along the boards. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Puts it in deep. The Wolfpack have gained control of the puck along the wall. And he slides it quickly to Thompson. Hershey's got it in the neutral zone. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Takes the feet at the back end. Sends the pass down low. And that's blocked! And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. In the final moments of this period, Hartford still down by two goals in this one. Nice job tying up his opponent. Nice pass. Here they are on the attack. Centering pass, and that's picked off. Hershey's looking to break out. Sends a pass over. The Bears take it along the wall. Hartford's gained possession along the boards. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. The Wolfpack have taken to the offensive attack and uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. And he slides it quickly to Sprong. Second period nearly in the books here. Played big in the moment there. Had to be sharp. That's a great A chance. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. Faceoff here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. From the slot, stones him in front. Right from the most dangerous area on the ice, the goalie flashes the glove. That's an arrogant stop. Hershey's been the better team tonight, and they lead as a result late in the second. The Bears win the draw. Puts it up front. Here's a blast. And that sails over the net. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. Oh, at the buzzer, a big save. And the sound of the horn will wrap things up for period number two in what has been a tightly contested affair. to Delmans, proud sponsor of tonight's game. With 70 stores and 14 restaurants, Delmans has it all. The third period is just around the corner. Ray and I will bring you all the action in a moment. Players are set, officials are set, third period action is coming up. Here we go, put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period, we are underway. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Takes the feed. Moves the puck. Loses his balance on the play. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Picks off the pass in the defensive zone. The Bears get a hold of the puck along the boards. The Wolfpack have taken over in the neutral zone. Chase right in front. Gets the glove on it. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. The Bears will play it from the defensive zone. Not able to connect. Scoops up the puck here. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Takes the feed. Pokes it away in his own end. Slides the puck to Sprong. 
Great defensive effort with the stick. The Wolfpack have the puck against the boards. Grabs it in his own end. Scrum along the boards. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Denied that one. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looks like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. The Bears have put a lot of pucks on net, and as a result, they lead it early in this third period. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Moves it quickly over to Brodzinski. Takes the pass. Takes it from the other side of the blue line. Dismiss that chance. Copley's job is not just to stop the puck, but get it out of danger. He does that here. Oh, you'll win respect for your teammates doing that. What a block. Sends the pass over. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. The Bears scoop it up along Whoa. the boards. He scores! On the one-timer, two sweep! The goalie's probably got to stop this, but I don't think he's set, James. That turnover didn't give him much time to get set in the net. She's added to their lead here in this third period. It's been nonstop. I like how they've scored and then gone after the next one, James. They've had their foot down on the gas pedal the whole night. Scored by number 18, Garrett. And he puts that one aside with ease. Lots of time left in this period. The Bears have taken control of this one, now leading by three. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Receives the pass. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Oh, sometimes you think you've got lots of room to make a move. Not there. He got closed down and hammered. What a hit. Hershey's laying up, pounding on the opposition tonight, generating numerous scoring chances and converting on what feels like almost all of them. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. The Bears gain possession along the wall. The Wolfpack have taken possession in their own end. Tosses it to Fontaine. Thompson's got it into offensive territory. Hartford's got it behind the net. Stones him on the one-timer. Pokes the puck away. Here's an offensive chance. No one home on that play. Scrum ensues along the boards. Hershey's got a hold of it against the wall. The Bears ready to go on the attack. Hartford's got the puck in the defensive end. Down the right side and into the zone. Sends it over, and that one's broken up. Hershey's on the attack. Nice poke check. Here's a short pass to Johansson. Takes it at center. Goes right to the crease. Save made by the goalie. And the parade to the penalty box will continue as play is called for yet another penalty. A little too much stick and body hooking up on this one, hence booking on the goal. Yeah, I, I didn't think this was a difficult call for the official to make at all. The Bears send their man advantage unit out once more. They've talked in the last week about really trying to be more aggressive on the power play. They were earlier on, and their coach has got to be pleased with the results so far. Wax it into the offensive zone. Hershey's got the puck behind the net. Across the line from center. Slides the puck over. Nice pass. Point shot. Oh, Ray, that offer 
opportunity right there. He's got to get this on the net. When it's on the net, there's a chance for a rebound. There's a chance for traffic to converge. Over the net, plays over. Gains the zone on the left wing. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Nieves gains the zone. The Bears gain control of the puck against the wall. I don't believe the coaches are going to be too worried about this. They didn't score on the power play, but I think it's most important that they didn't give anything up. They've got such a nice lead. The coaches are more focused on making sure this game plays out comfortably. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. The Bears' offense has been the story tonight as they continue to lead big time in the third. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Carries it in. Coughs up the puck after that hit. Into the attacking area from the left side. Great read to break up the play. Slides the pass over to Carr. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Hammers a shot, and that one stopped. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Hartford's got it along the wall. Here's a shot. No room for that one to get through. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Hershey's moving it into the offensive end. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. And it's been a pretty one-sided affair to this point. It's 4-1. Hartford's won the draw. Grabs the puck. Hartford's moving it along the wing. Here's a chance. Hartford's got it now. Oh, a little too much stick work. And the officials with their arms in the air. Let's see what the officials say. The Wolfpack have to deal with two minutes in the sin bin for hooking. Well, when you stop your feet, you're almost advertising to the official to keep looking. There's the hook. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. When we talked to both coaches, they talked about how important the power play was. What I like about this team, though, they've already scored, and they look like they're hungry for more. Handles the puck. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Here he is in front. Can't connect. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. The Bears move the puck in the defensive zone. Sends a pass over. To the low slot. Quick shot. How do you miss that, Ray? I don't know, but we all do. You're right in a scoring zone, and you don't even test the goalie. Passes it to Nieves. Can't catch up to the pass. Pucks the puck away. Now a quick pass to Pilon. Both sides are evened up as the power play has expired. They did enough to kill this penalty off. It's not been a great night for him. It's been just an average. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Scoops up the puck now. Maintains possession. There's the whistle stopping the play. Penalty coming up. I don't think this will have much of an impact on this one. And he's off to the box for two for tripping. Not much of an argument there. A stick between the player's feet. Another power play opportunity coming up here as they set up at the faceoff. I wouldn't say they have to go right back to the drawing board, but whatever's next to the drawing board, they might want to get there. They've had a little success, but it's not looked very good. Trying to get back on the attack now. Coughs it up on the play. Hershey's moving it up the ice. And he regains control of the puck. Battle along the boards. The Bears move it ahead. Takes the feed at center from the right wing. Stopped by the goaltender. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. Gains the zone through center. Along the half wall with the puck. Nothing doing on that. Oh, he put it just wide as it hits the outside of the post. Hartford's shot hits the goalpost, doesn't go in. And if they're ever going to get back in this, James, they're going to need a couple of bounces. 
And the goaltender covers things up. All sorts of frantic action in front of the net. Yeah, everybody's scrambling around trying to help. What's happening is everybody's getting out of position. They needed some help. They got it from the goaltender. Hershey's up big time here in the late stages of this third period. Jones has won the draw. Both sides back to even strength. Oh, he stops it with the glove. Great reflexes there. Here in the late goings of the period, the Bears are giving their fans a lot to cheer about tonight as they lead it 4-1. Setters jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Taken by Sprong. On the attack along the boards. Great heads-up play in the defensive zone. Gets a hold of the puck behind the net. Coming up on the final minute of regulation time. In the third period. Couldn't complete the play. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Club save, but an easy one at that. Hershey's been the better team offensively tonight. A lot of scoring chances, and they lead it late in this third period. Hartford's won the draw. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Up along the wing. Keeps hold of the puck. Puts it on net. Makes the save. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Snatches the puck with the two centermen locked up. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Off the stick! The Wolfpack have gained possession off the wall. Hartford's got control of it now from their own end. Aaron pass and the play's broken up. Puck check inside the attacking zone. The same solid team effort in round one that pushed them here has carried through, and they're rolling on. Comes up with the stop. Kincaid's able to use all the gear here. This is a stick save on the scoring chance. Hershey's offense has not been a problem tonight. They put a lot of shots on net and lead it big time late in this third period. There's the final horn, and that'll do it here this evening. How big is that win tonight to break that deadlock? All the pressure goes to your opponents. I mean, it's such a critical, pivotal game. This game five always seems to have a big impact on a series. A lot of smiles as they make their way through the ceremonial handshake, and rightly so. They were good this series. They were good this series. They've really deserved to be on the winning side of this. They were just able to execute a few more plays at critical times. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us tonight.